The Territorial Cup ended in walk-off fashion as number 13 Sun Devil Softball took down their rival Wildcats 4-3 in eight innings, winning the battle for State 48 for the first time since 2015. Allison Royalty! It would be freshman Allison Royalty making her third start of the series, pitching for three and a third innings before being relieved by Lindsay Lopez. The Sun Devil offense would strike first as Danae Chapman took to the plate, smashing two shots out of the park in the second and fourth and racking up three RBIs. For me, because I've been struggling, I decided that I was going to swing hard no matter what was happening, and um, it worked out. <laughs> and it's amazing. Like We haven't done it since 2015. This is something we've really been working for. We really made sure we put all of our energy into all of our teammates, and we all came together to get this win. The number eight Wildcats answered with a home run of their own in the fourth and managed to tie the game on their final out on an RBI double, sending the game into extras. The Wildcats threatened with a runner on, but Lopez was able to hold them scoreless in the eighth. Bottom of the frame, Jasmine Hill would battle in a long at bat that ended in a single, setting up Maddie Hackbarth with the chance to win it. And she called game. Ripping a shot down the left field line, bringing home Hill for the walk-off win and conference sweep over their rivals. Um, I mean, I'm feeling on cloud nine. <laughs> I'm very excited of, uh, to be a part of this program and just, just to come out here and play softball. So that was huge for us and the program. Um, going into my last at bat, I knew, I knew what I was going to get. Um, I just knew that I'd keep it simple, have some fun, get a good pitch, put barrel on it like I, I've been doing all season. Um, and yeah. The Sun Devils winning all three conference games in the four-game series, now 9-6 and six in the Pac-12. They'll be on the road next week as they take on Cal. For Cronkite Sports, I'm Jude Binkley.